The exercise of the Shila Boys cult group, drug abuse among youths, and other heinous crimes perpetrated in Ola North took center stage. The district head of Jemeta, representatives of security agencies, ward heads, religious leaders, and a vigilante converge on Yolo Note Council Office to discuss ways of checkmating the problems. Member representing Yolo Note, Suleiman Alik Ali, expressed concern that Jemeta, the center of governance, has become unsafe for residents at daytime and at night. <laughs> One number banded in the Shesam Kachim Kira meeting, the Masuji Milu, the Shukabanin Adini, the Shukabanin Jamians Aro, Muzom Zauna, Tatauna, Mukatawani Hanya, Zamu Auka, Owa Nemataki Zamu Auka Dumu Maga and Chiwana Mazamuki to Kedish. In Yazamu Yu Committee, Sakani soldier that answered the DSS, the Masuji Milu, the Mu, Mudigida Gida, Mufitar the way in Nayara. The lawmaker who is in the notion that his job is not only to make laws but also to ensure the security of his constituency emphasizes that all hands must be on deck to save the lives and property of the residents. The district head of Jemeta, Muhammad Inouababab Harris, is worried that people in Jemeta now live in fear as a result of the criminality of the Shila boys and call on the stakeholders to be alert. May they say, I don't know when the bus the carfin called a book around with a woman at Jim Casa, the ma peaceful the so agimeter. Muna the government won the time on a comic, Sanayara, and Kanimuzum or Buddha Susu Gagara, Mugagara controlling us. Mushin and Mukachea come out and Mukira Jamins or Muko surrender. We have surrendered to you. Other speakers highlighted various tactics used by the cult groups to include the use of almighty snatching bags and money at ATM pay points, among others. They pledged their readiness to work as a team in order to bring lasting solution to the issues. Abdullah Ibrahim, 2-6 News.